गाइज आज मैं मानेसर आया हूँ एंड इन टूडेज वीडियो ऑफ दी आई एम गाई कैंपस डायरीज आई एम कवरिंग अ कॉलेज जिसको आप देख सकते हो इट्स अ वेरी न्यू बी स्कूल बट इज ग्रोइंग बाई लीप्स एंड बाउंड सॉइल इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ मैनेजमेंट लेट मी टेल यू फ्यू फैक्ट्स अबाउट सॉइल थर्टी टू कंपनीज है को क्रिएटेड सॉइल तो इससे क्या हो रहा है इन्होंने बहुत सारे प्रैक्टिकल एलिमेंट्स को लेकर जो कॉपरेट में काम आता है ये बी स्कूल का करिकुलम और सब कुछ डिज़ाइन किया है यहाँ पर डिज़ाइन थिंकिंग लिबरल आर्ट्स और ह्यूमैनिटीज़ के बहुत सारे एलिमेंट्स कवर है जो आपको सारे आंसर्स में आप आपके जो स्टूडेंट्स कैंपस एक्सपीरियंसेस बताएंगे यू विल हियर अ लॉट अबाउट देम रैंकिंग्स की बात करें तो इंडिया टुडे हैज़ रैंक सॉइल एज 21, 21 फर्स्ट एवं द स्टैंड अलोन प्राइवेट कॉलेजेस ऑफ इंडिया मैनेजमेंट इंस्टीट्यूट्स ऑफ इंडिया इस वीडियो में वे गो कवर अबाउट लाइफ एट सॉइल वे गो कवर वाइड पीपल चूज सॉइल आउट ऑफ द ऑप्शन दैट दे हैव एंड क्या क्या यू हैं सॉइल के Guys, I have with me Priyanshi Jain. She is a first-year student of, at the PGDM program of Soil. I'm going to ask her what were the options that she had maybe before joining Soil, and what attracted her to Soil. Can you tell these two things to our viewers? Okay, so the options that I had were Wellinka, Symbiosis, Tapmi, Four. These, these are were, some great options. Yeah. Okay, okay. So why did you choose Soil, leaving all of these colleges? Well, there are many reasons uh, for that, but I'll mention a few. a uh, number one reason was definitely when you go ahead and like you know google about soil you uh, there's one face that you see and that is the face of anil sachdev yes, sir i saw right? that myself yes yeah, yeah. Right. so there are so many videos where he talks about leadership where he talks about ethics design thinking innovation so that attracted me towards uh, soil that was like that was like a curiosity point like what is this about okay. and why not many business schools are talking about this these are some great points that you answered priyanshi can you tell about your experience at soil then Oh, wonderful! Uh, the experience has been wonderful as of uh, until yet. Honestly, uh, there have been a few things that are comparatively different. To uh, I have had conversation with my friends from different B schools, right? And um, one thing that is that uh, you know that is the USP of Soil is uh, the design thinking uh, workshops that we, they conduct here. Uh, so all of all the batch we sit together and then we uh, you know think about the products and like we, that's like uh, design thinking when I talk about is out of the box thinking, mm -hmm. right? So we go into the practical world. We uh, think about the practicality. So that is one thing. Then there are experiential Fridays that focuses on innovation, focuses on uh, again design thinking process of it. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that this is uh, how the experience has been practical. Is uh, the word that I'll use. When you say experiential Fridays, yes. what did you? How do you do it? And what did you gain out of this? So in Experiential Friday, we have uh, industry experts uh, from different different arenas, say from marketing, from finance, from HR, operations, and analytics. Mm. Uh, so they come here, they conduct lectures, and not just like it's not just them speaking and uh, us listening. Mm. It's also a lot about say chart papers we use to you know note down our ideas, mm. all of that. So it's it's an it's a practical approach for different business problems. I also heard something about an AI week, which oh. is also one of the USPs of Soil. Could you elaborate some on that? For sure. Uh, so AI Week is the Academic Industry Week. So this this goes on for like one month, or uh, one week rather, mm -hmm. uh, where again we get uh, industry experts from different fields, mm -hmm. and then uh, this is like a whole uh, one day. Uh, say we have one dedicated uh, day to certain say marketing, and then we have finance for operations, where uh, we understand about the industry part of it. On that note, I want to stop you and ask you, which are a few leaders who like visited soil? Oh, there are many, uh, but uh, a few are there in the, on the top of my mind at the moment. Uh, I'd say IKEA CEO. Uh, she came here, uh, and she talked about leadership in in the most uh, different manner, and the, that was interesting. And then uh, Akshay Ambar sir also came from Viva. He's a marketing uh, person from Viva itself, and CHRO of Tech Mahindra. So uh, these are a few names. Let's now delve more into a typical day in the life of a soil student. So we have with us two more people from Soil PGDM's program, Soil's PGDM program. Tell us which are different clubs and committees at Soil. Are you part of a particular club and committee? Tell us about that. So Soil have this beautiful way of creating different clubs and academies. Here we have cultural club, sports club. We have a design thinking club as well. Mm -hmm. I personally serve as the president of a cultures club, wow. and usually here our day is a mix of you know different activities. Mm. Sometimes we are very much you know uh, intact with the academic stuff which we have, and because of multiple clubs which we have, we usually have different uh, uh, events coming through each week. So our days are mostly plan uh, goes around like planning the activities for an organize for a event, 
typically how much time after what time say 4 pm 5 pm do you get free from classes and then how much time do you engage in these other extra curricular activities so our day usually starts around 9 o'clock where we start uh, with our morning circle usually mm -hmm. our classes are around uh, till 4:30 after that we usually stay back at campus for you know organizing different activities for different events and after that we usually go back to our hostels or different pgs where we have this uh, beautiful peer to peer learning sessions we prepare for uh, next day's case studies or we usually sometimes just you know sit there and talk to each other as here in soil we have a 25 states representation so the diversity 25 states so the diversity here is just something to actually look upon to we actually meet to, we tend to meet people from different spans of life they were like people from kerala to jammu and i think the experiences which they share actually adds a lot of value to us as well i think that's one of the most beautiful uh, part of that two questions how far are the hostels from here secondly they say that in mba you only see for 3 4 hours is it true how hectic is the life at soil so we have a hostel you know within 1.5 to 2 kilometers away from the college and we also have a shuttle services so talking about uh, the committees you know we sometimes have the meeting after the classes like around 5 to 5:30 where we have to discuss uh, with the presidents and all you know what are the things that have to be planned you know uh, we on sundays or saturdays you know we just go out for the sponsorships and sometimes we also do it on the phone calls basis online meetings and all yeah and to the hostel usually we just uh, go around like 6 to 6:30 it depends and after that you know we just uh, relax for some time take a nap or something after that we also have a discussion with our friends you know regarding presentations or the case studies and we work on it and then uh, have our dinner around 9 o'clock and then uh, we might also as we are part of the clubs we have to just put some extra effort into it for like 1 hour Sure. and then just go back and just relax what i want to know from you now is apart from all the beautiful things that your friends have said soil is also located in delhi ncr how does this strategic location help you as mba students so after our mba we are planning to go to industries join corporates so being near to gurgaon obviously gives us an upper hand because we have guest lectures here where people from the industry come and tell us about the industry trends the current requirements that the industry has and all the things that are relevant in the industry now so obviously it becomes easier for them to come in from gurgaon and tell rather than flying them in from the other parts of the country makes sense also the industry visits we also have industry visits organized for us where we go to the industries and we see how industries actually function so yeah that gives us an upper hand there if someone is exploring soil as one of the options wants to do an mba now that we spend a lot of time here what would you tell someone why should someone join soil i would personally suggest them uh, that they, they should definitely consider soil because uh, when i was uh, looking out for options soil was one of the best suited option for me because i saw that it was co-created by 32 uh, companies like uh, asian paints tata motors yeah. maruti suzuki and so on and uh, also the usp of uh, this college is design thinking which i think uh, attracted me the most apart from that uh, the rural management programs the himalayan uh, journeys uh, gives us an upper edge and uh, that's why i think uh, we should uh, definitely consider soil for the past one year that i have been here uh, there have been numerous such amazing experiences that soil has given us like the himalayan retreat like there was a huge group of kids from new zealand who came us and we had the student exchange program and then we were given various guest lectures and you know various case studies and everything so that built our perspective but talking about the most special of them all i would say the rural immersion program the himalayan retreat that happened in himachal pradesh in bali last year mm. and this was extremely special to us we were there the entire batch was there for like 4 5 days and we were given exposure to not just talking to the localites but we were also given training regarding design thinking we were also given exposure regarding you know going to the nearby villages and talking to them and seeing on a day to day basis what their struggle was how could we empathize what changes could we make if we could contribute in some way and in the same way you know the himalayan uh, culture has a own handicraft and culture of its own which is very very unique unlike the city's experience uh, at all through the year So talking about that, uh, we were interacting with various people, and there were various self-help groups, and there were various levels at which soil was also contributing to them. And we were thankful that we could be a part of it. So uh, it was definitely a wonderful and a memorable experience, and one to cherish for life. And uh, I would really like to thank soil for giving us one such. Experience. Guys, हमने देखा इस वीडियो में कि सॉइल के स्टूडेंट्स 
वट आर डिफरेंट एक्सपीरियंसिस दैट दे आर लिविंग इन दिस बी स्कूल काफ़ी अलग सारी चीज़ें हैं डिज़ाइन थिंकिंग लोगों ने बताया अपने अलग एन जी ओ के एक्सपीरियंसिस बताया हिमालयन एक्सपीरियंसिस बताया बहुत सारे एक्सपीरियंसिस जो कि आपको हर बी स्कूल में नहीं मिलता दे आर सो मेनी कंपनीज हैव हेल्प स्टैब्लिश दिस कॉलेज इस ऑल्सो वन ऑफ दी की डिफ्रेंशिएटर्स ऑफ सॉइल अगर आपको सॉइल अच्छा लग रहा है मैं जरूर बोलूँगा आप इसमें अप्लाई करो इट्स वन ऑफ द गुड ऑप्शन दैट यू कैन हैव बिकॉज ये सिर्फ कट ऑफ के स्कोर पे नहीं लेता है प्रोफाइल बेस्ड एडमिशन होते हैं यहाँ पे विच हेल्प्स यू अलॉट अल्टीमेटली एम बी एज लोग अच्छा तभी बनेंगे जब उनका प्रोफाइल अच्छा हो जब वो टैलेंटेड हो एग्जाम क्रैक करने से सब कुछ नहीं होता है सो आई वुड रियली वॉन्ट यू टू कंसिडर इज एज वन ऑफ द ऑप्शन स्टे सेफ एंड टेक केयर